Hey y'all, welcome to my channel. This is Miss Mother Trucker. Believe it or not, now uh, Prime has announced that they are going back to 30,000 miles for their TNT instead of 50. And I remember when my student before the last one was on, he was like 100 miles short of his 50,000. And they made him stay on because I went out for surgery, they made, when he came in, they told him he had to either, either go do a recovery on a truck or he had to get on with another trainer and go out because that 100 miles would make the difference on how safe he was. Really, um, let's think about this. They're going to have him go do a recovery for a truck, an abandoned truck. Well, if he wasn't safe enough after 49,900 miles, what made him more safe after, why was he safe enough to go do a truck recovery and a load recovery? No, that dog don't hunt. And then how did all of a sudden, all these other people that are just starting into trucking, why are they safe? 20,000 miles earlier than the batch a month ago. What it is, what I think it is, is people are, Prime needs, they've lost a lot of drivers and a lot of trainers. So they're like, hey, come on, come on, come on in. You know, they're bringing back people that they wouldn't hire back before that used to work for Prime. And now, you know, they're trying to get people in because you know, no one wants to come in and do 50,000 miles TNT. That is ridiculous. I always said it was ridiculous, and I didn't support that. 30,000? I think that's almost too much. It depends. I think they should come in, do a month with the TNT trainer, and then review them, talk to the TNT trainer about it, and say, hey, is this person ready yet? Do they need more? training or what but that's not how they do it so to me it's just what Prime's needs are at the time it's not have it does not have anything to do with the safety of the driver or the capability of the driver otherwise they won't go willy-nilly uh, 30,000 miles 50,000 miles it's not to, to do with how safe the student is it has to do with what's best for Prime and you know if they would say that hey all the better but they don't but i it's why one of the reasons i'm not part of the training program anymore i just no you know i love prime i have really enjoyed my time at prime but that is a sticking thing for me and you know a lot of trainers it's one of the reasons they stopped training Fifty thousand miles is way too much um having to pay the students more way too much you know prime needs to pick up part of that it's just not fair because trainers are losing money training you know it's one thing if we're making the same or a little more but when you're actually losing money and your students making more than you are and you're a lease op or an owner op but it's just not cool it's not but now that's just my opinion i'm glad they pulled back the miles but just give it time and they're going to shoot them back up when it's convenient. But it has nothing to do with the safety. You know, that's what that safety says. You know, we found out that this is a perfect formula for us at 50,000 when I was arguing for my student. Saying, hey, he's a great driver. He was a driver 18 years ago for 12 years. You know, he, he's a good driver. You know, I mean, he got his groove back and he's, he's, he knew more than I did. Um, but they go, well, we think our formula works. No, it had nothing to do with the safety. And you just proved it by switching it back to 30,000 miles. Either that or you're saying, I give a shit about safety. Which is it? Anyway, guys, you know, like I said, Prime has so many pluses. I still think they're the best company to start at. 
I think they have the best lease program, the best purchase program. But right now, I mean, we just don't have the freight. We don't have the freight, and the freight we do have isn't paying worth a damn. You know, I don't know what it's like out there. I don't work for Swift. I don't work for OTRX. I don't work for Crete. I don't work for a lot of these. So all I hear is it's bad everywhere. I don't know. I don't. I'm going to get into RV hauling. Um, I will absolutely miss Prime when I do leave. I love Prime. I don't love Prime. Prime just a company. I love my dispatcher. I love my finance lady. Prime is just a company. You know, um, I'm not a job hopper. So, anyway, guys, just wanted to put in my two cents worth. Like I said, I don't think the miles has anything to do with safety. And Prime knows it. You know it. Everybody knows it, but that's just the what they pitch, and it's mm, no. So anyway, guys, until next time, this mother trucker out. Mm, bye bye.